Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to talk about another problem that we got from 2018 Hong Kong Mass Olympiad. In this geometry problem, we have a triangle inside the circle. We know sides of the triangle are 7, 8, and 6. We also know that we have two equal chords as AD and BD. We want to find power of two of segment lengths AD. Before moving forward to talk about the solution, make sure that you pause the video to think about the problem. To solve the problem, we first start by connecting the two edge using a perpendicular. Since we have equal chords for AD and BD, and we have a right angle at H, we can show that AH is equal to BH and each one is equal to 3, because in total AB is equal to 6. Now let's connect C to D. In this case, we know that C2 and A1 are in front of the same chord, so they are equal. We also know that C1 is equal to C2 because we have two equal chords for AD and BD, so they are equal too. Remember, we want to find the value that we can have for segment AD. Segment AD is one of the sides in the triangle that we have in red here. AHD or the red triangle here is a right triangle. And we can write AH as AD cosine of A1. If we rearrange the equation, we can find AD squared is equal to AH over cosine of A1 squared. A1 is equal to C1 is equal to C2. So instead of writing AH over cosine of A1 squared, we can write AH divided by cosine of C2 squared. And we know AH is equal to 3. So overall, we have AD squared is equal to 9 over cosine of C over 2 squared. In this equation, the only thing that is missing is cosine of C over 2. To find cosine of C, we can use law of cosines. For a triangle with sides A, B, and C, and angles alpha, beta, and gamma, we can write A squared is equal to B squared plus C squared minus 2 times b times c cosine of alpha. Therefore, we can find cosine of c in the triangle that we have here in yellow. We can write 6 squared is equal to 7 squared plus 8 squared minus 2 times 7 times 8 times cosine of c. This way, we can find cosine of c as 11 over 16. Now let's go back to the equation that we found. We found that AD squared is equal to 9 over cosine of C over 2 squared. We know what cosine of C is. And we know we can write cosine of C based on cosine of C over 2. If we use the identity that we have here, we can simplify the equation that we have for AD squared and we can find the final value that we can have for it. And the final answer is 32 over 3. Now let's summarize what we've done to solve this problem. We knew that AD and BD are two equal chords. We use this property to divide angle C into two equal angles. Then we construct a right triangle to include AD. 
we use law of cosines to find the value that we can have for cosine of c and then we use the properties of right triangle to find the value that we can have for ad based on the value that we can have for ab and cosine of c and then we found the final answer thanks for watching the video if you would like to see more puzzle and less involved activities please subscribe to the channel